Welcome back to Prime Time Sports Friday. Jamaican Winter Olympian Jasmine Fenletta Victorian has been given the green light to resume her career by the International Bobsleigh and Skeleton Federation following a disciplinary proceedings over a doping violation from last January. Kayon Rayner reports. A provisional ban imposed by the International Bobsleigh and Skeleton Federation on Jamaican Winter Olympian Jasmine Finlater Victorian has been lifted, clearing the way for her to resume training and competing. That's the word from President of the Jamaica Bobsleigh Federation, JBF, Christian Stokes, who spoke with TVJ Sports by telephone on Friday. She was serving a provisional uh, suspension while her case was being considered. We were notified that as of March 9th, uh, that is last month, that provisional suspension was lifted and is pending finalization of an agreement between the parties. But as of now, uh, she can train and compete in the sport of bobsleigh anywhere in the world. This comes after 14 months of disciplinary proceedings, which started after the 33-year-old Olympian returned a positive test for the banned drug clenbuterol weeks prior to the Winter Games in Pyeongchang, South Korea. Sample taken from Finlater Victorian during competition on January 13, 2018 in Switzerland showed traces of the banned anabolic steroid clenbuterol, which meant she faced a possible four-year ban. So the international body did not give specifics as to whether or not she will still face the possibility of that four-year ban which she faced for well, the, Luther. That sort of matter remains uh, something to be dealt with between her attorneys and the International Bobsleigh and Skeleton Federation. From the point of view of the Jamaica Bobsleigh and Skeleton Federation, what we have been told, what we have been clear on, what applies to any bobsleigh track in the world is that Jasmine is per permitted to resume training and competition as a bobsleigh athlete. The, suspend the provisional suspension has been lifted. Neither Fenlater Victorian, who was represented by UK-based lawyer Mike Morgan, nor the IBSF, which is located in Switzerland, responded to emailed queries from TVJ Sports about the Jamaican's case on Friday. The Jamaican team of driver Fenlater Victorian and former track and field sprinter Kari Russell ended 19th of 20 teams in the two-woman bobsleigh in Pyeongchang, South Korea. Reporting for TVJ Sports, I'm Keon Rayner.